can't tell you how many influencers have been like, look at my nail polish. I'm like, bitch, what the hell? You better push those cuticles back and stop playing games. All right, I need to relax. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sonia, and in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing my latest haul from CVS. CVS! I only went for <laughs> clear nail polish, and I came out with $200 worth of stuff, and I cannot wait to share all the goodies that I grabbed. Some things are like super random, so just sit tight. Hopefully you guys are comfortable. But before we get into this video, don't forget to like, share, and also subscribe to this channel if you have not already joined my family. Woo -woo! And let's get started. Okay, so this bag is like extra crunchy. If you're wearing headphones, I'm gonna get on your freaking nerves, so let me just take, let me just take everything out. Crunch, crunch, crunch. All right. First thing I should mention is probably my lip color because I just purchased that in this haul and it's from Maybelline. This is the Maybelline New York Super Stay Matte Ink and it's in the shade number 270 Cocoa Connoisseur. I love it. It's really dark and it's not sticky and when you apply it, it's super creamy. It doesn't transfer either. If you're like a psycho kisser, maybe. If you're making out with somebody, maybe. But if you're just doing like a Latina kiss, there's no transfer, which I love. I also got two other glosses from Maybelline. This is from their Lifter Gloss Collection. It includes hyaluronic acid in the formula, so it's supposed to promote hydration, plumpness in your lips. I don't know if it's going to be tingling or anything like that. I don't want them to get dirty, but I'm going to tell you the two colors that I got. I got number three, Moon, and number four, Silk. Beautiful, like, nudie, mauve colors that go well with my skin tone, so that's why I picked those up. Now, another makeup item that I purchased is this one here from CoverGirl, and this is their Clean Fresh Compact. I got the color 140 Light. Let me tell you guys something. I'm allergic to the sun. I did not know this until I had an allergy test done on me recently because I broke out in hives and I didn't know what I ate and I was scared that it was pumpkin flavored coffee. No! I'm actually allergic to sun. What the frick? I have to stay away from the sun and that's why all my friends are nice and sun kissed and I'm the see through one. You can see all of my veins and <laughs> it's fine. This is the CoverGirl Clean Fresh Healthy Look Pressed Powder and I was in between the light or the medium, and the medium was way too dark looking. It also comes with a little powder puff, but I use a brush, so I just, to be honest with you guys, I like it because it's pink. Also, I painted my nails, I think it was last night or the night before, I don't remember, because then these days are getting so flippin' long. Beautiful, like, army green color. This is in Susie, the First Lady of Nails, and it's from OPI. I tried out this OPI Infinite Shine, and to be honest with you guys, I don't like it. I also got another nail polish from OPI. This is called Check Out the Old Geezer, and it reminds me of watching Love Island UK. It's my favorite. I haven't watched Love Island here in the US, but the UK version is my favorite. Obsessed. Me and Jude wanted to go and like live or stay in the UK for at least a month. And I was so down. This this summer we were supposed to do that, but COVID happened and did all up. But I'm so glad that I picked up another top coat. And this is from Eternal. I think that's the name of the brand, Eternal. And this was only a dollar ninety-nine versus the eight dollars. This could be eight to ten dollars depending on where you get such a beat, because you can find it at Sally's. Um, but this was only $1.99 and then they also had a deal where if you got two of their polishes You can get two for five bucks, I believe, but let me tell you I was really happy look how shiny my nails are my nails are super shiny and You don't need a lamp you can just paint it and it was pretty quick but to be completely honest with you guys such a V is worth the price tag and worth hunting after because it is the bomb. I, I don't know why it is, but every time you paint your nails, you always have to go pee, right? You're like, ah, oh, I have to go pee and I can't even take my pants down because my nails are wet. This is in number 22, Blackjack. Like I said, it's almost black, but it's not. Can you see that? It's got like this blue shimmer in it. It's really, really pretty. And this one is called 296 French Pink. So pretty. Here is my Duo Black. It is like done. I'm practically gonna have to start rolling it. So I got another one. 
This is my favorite. It's a dark tone. So when you put it on your strip, it goes on like a gray color and then it dries black. Next up, since I am already experiencing some serious dry mouth and it's not because your girl smokes. Okay, relax. I got these Thera Breath. Is that how you say it? Dentist formulated dry mouth lodgings and uh, it says helps relieves dry mouth symptoms, restores fresh breath instantly. I am taking a medication that dries my mouth out, so I'm constantly filling up with water. So I always have water on hand because I get so thirsty and then I start to hear my voice change like it is right now. And then also my mouth like, anyways, if you are taking medication that gives you the side effect of having dry mouth, or you like to light things up on fire and inhale and it gives you dry mouth, um, you probably wanna invest in something like this. My mom works for a dentist and um, she always tells me like, make sure that you are rinsing your mouth, make sure you're staying hydrated because dry the dry mouth symptoms don't only dry your mouth out, but it also causes like bacteria, and tooth decay, and all kinds of other oral problems. So you wanna make sure you guys take care of that if it's happening to you. For me, I was just drinking a bunch of water, but then I get filled up on water and I don't have any room for much food. So yeah, it was becoming a problem. So I'm going to have, I'm gonna actually have one of these. I hope they're good. They came in this mandarin and mint, or it was a berry and mint, I believe. Mmm. My mouth is watering. Hold on. <laughs> to be continued, I need to put that back in my mouth after I'm done with this. My mouth is like super juicy now. I also got a black mask and this mask, I just got it honestly just because it's cute. My friend Crystal has a black, black mask and I thought it looked so cute. I have all these cute ones with Frida and like Mexican wrestlers, like all these like really cute prints. I have a ton of them because you have to wash. Please do not wear the same freaking mask every single day for weeks, months on end. Wash your masks and if they're disposable, please freaking throw them in the trash. It's so gross because all the bacteria from your mouth breathing out in here, curl. You know how gross that is? That's why people are breaking out all over their face. Anyways, so I have way too much makeup on to be wearing this mask, but anyways. You would put this on and look how much cuter it is because it's solid black. I know, I'm, I look like a ninja and that's why I like it. I also got this pack of eyelashes from Ardell and this is the Wispy, it's my favorite. It's similar to the style that I'm wearing right now. Um, these I've honestly probably worn way too many times. They just haven't fallen apart so I just keep wearing them. I believe, I wanna say they were like maybe $7 for five pairs versus paying $2.99 for one pair. I also got myself a new toothbrush and this is from Live Better and it's by CVS Health. It's a bamboo toothbrush with soft bristles. It's vegan, no BPA, so there's no plastic involved in this. Um, they're like wooden toothbrushes. One is white and one is black. I always like to keep an extra toothbrush here anyways. This is a two pack, I only need one. Uh, Jude has an electric toothbrush that I was sent that I forfeited and gave it to him because he needs it more than I do, okay? Let's be honest. I also got this um, nail polish remover. It says Pro Nail Polish Remover removes gel polish and nail polish strips, lifts away artificial nails as well. It's called Plus Optimize. I've never heard of this brand before. I was looking for a bottle that said 100% acetone and I did not see anything, so I'm hoping that this will do it, especially because it says it removes gel nail polish, so. I'm like, hey, that sounds like it's aggressive enough to go home with me because I need something to be aggressive, you know? You know? I got three more items to share with you guys. The next one is from Always. Is this, is this TMI? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're, we're, we're here, right? We're like family, duh. Okay, so these are the Always Pure Cotton with Flex Foam. This is my second box of these pads. And I, can I rave about pads for a second? Like, I love these pads. I don't wear tampons because I had a bad experience when I was in high school, uh, that's for another time. And I tried using like Diva Cups and things like that. Those are pretty tricky, but if you've got time to like maneuver them in there, you get your life. But for me, 
I typically wear like reusable pads here in my house, the ones that you can wash in the washer. Um, and then when I go out and about, I'm wearing pads like these or when I'm going to sleep. And they don't ruin my underwear. I have ruined so many pairs of underwear because of the aggressiveness. Because this is where I don't want you to be aggressive. Don't be aggressive in my underwears, okay? The pads, like the stickiness, the adhesive to your underwear, rip my freaking underwear. It's like when I pull the pad off, the pad came apart, my underwear's ripped. Girl, like three or four pairs. No joke. I also got some bobby pins. I don't think I'm gonna be changing my hair color anytime soon. I keep saying I want to. I really want to have Kristen S. Hopefully you guys know who that is. I wanna have her orangey red hair. That's the color that I want for my hair, honestly. Honest to God, and I want it to be cut this short. This short. Like, right when your hair is too short to put in a ponytail, that's how short I want my hair. So, anyways, I got some bobby pins, because you know how bobby pins, you use them, you take them out, and then they disappear. They go literally into the air, and they evaporate, and when you're at home, hanging out, and with nowhere to go, then they all show up. And last but not least, I got this uh, Beauty 360 Cuticle Pusher. This is my second one. I don't know where the first one went. Maybe you took it somewhere. I don't know. But yeah, it's just to push your cuticles back so that your nails look, you know, clean and professionally done. I can't tell you how many influencers have been like, look at my nail polish. I'm like, bitch, what the hell? You better push those cuticles back and stop playing games. All right, I need to relax. <laughs> but for real. Girls be crazy. Clean up your damn nails. Lord have mercy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you want to see in the comment section down below. I've been producing a lot of reels lately, so make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. Also, I'll be leaving a list of all the products that I showed you guys in today's video, including the shade numbers and names um, down there as well, so you guys want to check that out. But as always, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Um, my anxiety levels have been lowering significantly thanks to you guys. And I don't think I would ever say that about social media because it tends to be a very toxic place. But for us, like you and I and all of you guys, you guys have been so good to me. Like I could get emotional about it. Like you guys have really been really, really good to me to the point where I have been holding off on sharing information with you guys. I know it sounds shady as fuck, but it's not, I promise. You guys have been asking a lot of questions and I am feeling more inclined to tell you guys the answer to those questions, but make sure you guys stay tuned. Don't forget to like, share, and also subscribe to my channel if you have not already joined my family. And <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one.